Hey guys, Jafar here. This video will cover the SMG, starting with the ammo, followed by the custom SMG, Thompson, and MP5A4, with each stage explaining the damage, cost, attachments, and other features related to that gun. Let's first talk about the rounds the SMGs will be using. All SMGs will take a regular pistol bullet, high velocity bullet, and incendiary bullet. These bullets will affect the damage and velocity of the gun. The regular pistol bullet is the most commonly used and cheapest to obtain bullet, costing 10 metal frags and 5 gunpowder at a level 1 workbench to craft 4. The tech tree's total path cost to unlock this bullet is 490 scrap, while directly researching it will cost 75 scrap. The high velocity pistol bullet will increase the velocity and damage drop off range while maintaining the same damage as a regular pistol bullet and cost 10 metal fragments and 20 gunpowder at a level 2 workbench to craft 3. The tech tree's total path cost to unlock the high velocity bullet is 1100 scrap, while directly researching it costs 125 scrap. The incendiary bullet will increase the damage while decreasing the velocity, making it harder to hit moving targets, and will cost 10 metal fragments, 10 gunpowder, and 5 sulfur at a level 2 workbench to craft 3. The tech tree's total path cost totals 1,100 scrap, while directly researching it will cost 125 scrap. For this video, I will stick with the regular pistol bullet for all weapon statistics, as 99% of your fights are going to be using this ammo. Starting off, the custom SMG is a scary weapon to be facing off with up close, as it's easy to control with a fast fire rate. The custom SMG requires a level 2 workbench blueprint to craft, which can be obtained using its tech tree. The total tech tree path cost for this gun is 1350 scrap, while it can be researched directly for 125 scrap at a research table. The materials to craft a custom SMG include 8 high quality metal, 1 SMG body and 1 spring. The custom deals 30 damage up close to the chest and a rate of fire of 600 rounds per minute, with a range of 50 meters. These stats give the custom a 300 DPS. The custom can be recycled for a yield of 4 high quality metal and a 50% chance for an SMG body and metal spring. As for attachments, the custom can take all of them, which include the 16x scope, 8x scope, hollow sight, muzzle boost, muzzle brake, silencer, handmade sight, laser sight, and flashlight. I would recommend using the laser sight to improve accuracy and handmade sight. Finally, the custom can be found in a lock crate, supply drop, APC crate, elite tier crate, heli crate, heavy scientist, military crate, and oil rig scientist. The Thompson is a powerful mid-range SMG due to its slower fire rate which can be used in close range situations when needed, thanks to its high damage. The Thompson requires a level 2 workbench blueprint to craft and can be obtained using its tech tree. The total tech tree path cost for this gun is 1350 scrap, while it can be researched directly for 125 scrap. The materials to craft the Thompson include 10 high quality metal, 100 wood, 1 SMG body and 1 metal spring, slightly more expensive compared to the custom. The Thompson deals 38 damage up close to the chest and a rate of fire of 462 rounds per minute with a range of 90 meters. Overall these stats give the Thompson a 293 DPS. The Thompson can be recycled for a possible yield of 5 high quality metal, 50 wood, and a 50% chance for an SMG body, and a metal spring. As for attachments, the Thompson can take all attachments like the custom. I would recommend using the laser sight and hollow sight to improve accuracy for even more improved ranged combat. Finally, the Thompson can be found in a lock crate, supply drop, APC crate, elite tier crate, heli crate, heavy scientist, military crate, and oil rig scientist. The MP5A4 is the most modern, military grade and rarest SMG you can acquire, combining the best of both worlds from the Custom and Thompson to include a higher damage with a fast fire rate. The MP5 requires a level 3 workbench blueprint to craft and can be obtained using its tech tree. The total tech tree path cost for this gun is 250 scrap, 
while it can be researched directly for 125 scrap. The materials to craft the MP5 include 15 high quality metal, one SMG body and two metal springs. The MP5 deals 35 damage up close to the chest and a rate of fire of 600 rounds per minute with a range of 72 meters. Overall, the stats give the MP5 a 350 DPS, the greatest out of all SMGs. The MP5 can be recycled for a possible yield of eight high quality metal, one metal spring and a 50% chance for an SMG body. The MP5 can take all attachments. However, I would recommend the laser sight and hollow sight to improve its widespread. Finally, the MP5 can be found in a lock crate, supply drop, elite tier crate, APC crate, heli crate, military tunnel scientist, and heavy scientist. Early within a wipe, it can be great to quickly go to the military tunnels and kill a scientist to acquire an MP5, giving you a massive advantage. To sum up the SMGs, early game I would recommend the Custom due to its low cost to craft, mid game the Thompson for its extended range during battles, and late game the MP5 for its overall stats, rarity and learning curve. However, the recoil, magazine size and range will determine which gun will be better for each situation. Some fights the Custom will be preferred over the Thompson while others the Thompson will win due to its longer range bullet drop off. Play smart and use the right tool for the job. Thanks guys for watching and I hope to see you in the next video.